Hey everyone and welcome back to, to another Warzone video. On the last episode, we did actually get into Hero Rank. I'm so very happy that I was able to uh, achieve and get into Hero Rank. We did end up getting kicked out and uh, I think I'll, I'll look around and see if I still have the, any of the footage about it. If I was able to acquire like 50k more points, I, I would have been able to stay in and that would have been cool. Uh, I had the dark, the shadow forest and um, the fire stage that you normally would use, obviously a fire DPS, and which I don't have on the account built. So they basically screwed me over. Like I was trying and trying, I just couldn't get high enough score to stay into hero rank. So I ended up getting demoted, which is not too bad. It's a, it's a good experience pretty much to see what's actually up there, how the stages are and um, how basically your score is gonna, gonna play out and what kind of characters you need. So 100% if you're in hero rank, you want an elemental DPS for every one of the stages for sure. <laughs> It's a great experience and I was happy to try it out at least. But in this this Warzone video, we are going to be trying to get into Hero Rank again. The stages that I ended up getting again, Fire Stage and the Ice Stage. Two of my most favorite stages right now to, to, to use because I have no DPS for it. So that really kind of sucks. And I, I'm, you know what, I'm still actually surprised. I was have not been able to get a Lightning Stage to pop up since the start of this event that, that brought us with Bianca. I'm still astounded. I have not seen the lightning stage for me. So in this video, you know what? I said, screw it. I'm not waiting for the lightning stage anymore. I did finally build out my my Bianca. Basically, this this whole Warzone video is going to be about testing Bianca in other stages. As you can see, this time I did bring out my uh, my Liv that I was actually lucky enough to get triple S through pulling on the banner so far. So I brought her out and I threw, I threw the set that's on her for increasing your elemental damage. Plus giving you the heals. More helpful and accurate for the situations I really needed her for. And I did bring Karina. And as you can see, the member sets I did bring with her helped me increase my elemental damage by reducing their elemental resistance. And Bianca obviously is going to be on the four set Heisen and uh, two Fredericks. Some people think it's a little tedious to get uh, to set off Fredericks, but it sometimes it's not too bad. I, I'm really surprised at, at the DPS and the score I was actually to, I was actually able to acquire with uh, with my Bianca. Eased her in two zones that she's not meant for. It's not her elemental advantage. And she slapped. She honestly just nuked everything and it was so satisfying using her. <laughs> but uh, again, if you guys enjoy the gameplay, you find uh, you find the video helpful, informative, don't forget, don't be afraid to leave a like and subscribe. I will greatly appreciate it. It does help with the channel a lot. I'll see all of you in the next Punishing Grey Raven video. Peace.